Commanders fans, um, Carson Wentz has been placed on injured reserve, so he's going to miss the next four games. Uh, that's the Packers, the Colts, the Vikings, and the Monday Night Football Eagles game. So he will be missing both revenge games, the revenge game against the Colts and Jim Ursay um, in Indianapolis, and then also the game in Philly where I know he was going to get booed a lot out there in Philly on Monday Night Football. So he, he will be missing those four games. So um, it's Heineke time, man. I think, I really think, I think the game tomorrow is a winnable game against the Packers. Um, I really think the Colts game is a winnable game. Matt Ryan, you know, you've seen that he struggled. Their offensive line is a makeshift offensive line, just like our offensive line. Jonathan Taylor, I'm not sure if he's back yet or not, but the Colts haven't really, they've been, they haven't really played great football. They've been up and down. They did beat the Chiefs. And then that game against the Broncos, they look really bad, but they, they, their offensive line has given up a lot of pressure and sacks. And um, what's his name? Matt Ryan has has turned the ball over uh, a couple of times. So he struggled. he's had his struggles in Indianapolis. So I really think the Colts game is a winnable game. I really think the Packers game is a winnable game. I actually think the Vikings game against Kirk Cousins, call me crazy. I know this coaching staff is lackluster. Our coaching staff is lackluster and underwhelming. Our offensive line is darn bad too, but... I actually think they're winnable games. I really do. Um, the Eagles game was probably the toughest one out of the four. Um, but the Vikings defense is um, – they're underwhelming too. They're below average in my opinion. They give, they give up a lot of yards and points at times. So I, I really think they're winnable games. It's just the coaching staff and our offensive line that I just don't trust. Um, I actually do have some faith in Heineke because I think he's a, a mobile quarterback that can make something happen. And we saw what happened when he went on that four-game winning streak last year. And we just ran the football, you know. So that's what we got to do. We got to run the football. So um, Carson Wentz, I hope he recovers. But I think his time is done in Washington, to be honest with you. I don't see him playing another game um, in a commander's uniform, to be honest with you. Um, I think that's it for him. But, you know, Heineke, we'll see how Heineke does. Hopefully he stays healthy. A lot of people can get their wish within the next four weeks, too, and seeing Sam Howe. So, We'll see what happens. But Carson Wentz will be missing the next four games. He'll be out on injury reserve. I know they tried to keep him on the roster, kind of like how Dallas did with Dak, but they couldn't, you know, because, um, you know, he, he's just going to be out for a good amount of time. So, but uh, all right, you guys, you see, I, I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued by Heineke, man. I'm excited to see Heineke play tomorrow, man. I really am. I think he's going to make something happen against the Packers. The Packers have not been a good team this year, and I think we can run the football on them. We just got to stick to the run and play smash mouth football and ball control. That's what we got to do tomorrow against the against the Packers in our Commanders homecoming game. So, all right, you guys, health to Commanders. Peace.